you want to ensure is to integrate your herd app to Fortinac. Uh, by doing so, you go to you go to systems, go to settings, then under settings, you see authentication and see LDAP. So here you had, let's modify this. So this is the name CyberPoint as the domain server that I have within my environment. Uh, here's the IP address and here's the MAC address of the uh, network connected to it, which I'm going to show you. So to get this, you're going to go to your herd up server. So uh, go to your command. Ten dots fifteen dot is two hundred, and there's the MAC address. So you use the MAC address in this format, in this format, in column format, and put it there. Then use a service account that has a lead admin privileges to pull groups and users into Fortinac then validate the credentials ensure that the credential is valid go to additional settings uh on the do under the domain name give it the, do the domain name then uh, also enable uh, on sync the lead users no longer found in this directory so that uh the Fortinac will keep itself up to date then put the first word of your uh, domain name here so you click go to user attributes under here you click active directory and all other uh, information here will be populated go to group uh, uh, attributes leave it as default search branch under search branch you had search branch and you also select the first one which is dc across your domain and the dot com or dot local whichever you're using then click ok then under the group search as well you had it as well and also click ok then under select group you select i selected all because i want all the user groups to be part of what i'm going to uh, you know be able to authenticate when i'm done then you click ok so You've successfully integrated LDAP to uh, Fortinac.